Hey guys, this is the second time I'm at this video, and I guess because somebody wanted to be in the video, I was faced a different direction, but horrible double chin. Anyway, these are some don'ts with Santa Muerte, <clears throat> like <clears throat> adamant don'ts. I'm not going to spend a lot of time explaining why you're an adult, hopefully, and you can figure out why. And you can take this and run with it and put stock in it. Or you can just be like, I'm going to do my own thing and figure it out for yourself. Hey, whatever. But you like my ring? Don't give my ring a hole. I just got it. And I just made my own makeshift rosary to her. It's a coin with obsidian on the back of it. With, yeah, evil eye um, beads. I like it because I made it. <laughs> anyway, so number one, don't get drunk in front of her altar. Just don't. And you know what I mean, off your ass drunk to where it's embarrassing. Don't do that. Uh, and if I have to explain any of these, then you probably need to spend more time with her so that you can understand why. And, and like I said, before I continue, here's a disclaimer. I don't care what your practice is. I don't care what your religion is. I don't care where you sit with her. These, I thought them out, and I, I remembered when I did them, because I did a lot of them, and I remember the conversations I've had with people, and I know the conversations that I've had with people from Mexico um, as to why not, as to why they agree with me as to why not to do these things. If you want to debate them, you go ahead and you go into Mexico and you see how it's done. If you're so, if you want to do things the right way, if you want to do things how they're doing them over there, you go and see. If you don't care, fine, you don't care, whatever. So, don't get drunk in front of their altar. Number two, don't bang in front of the altar. Don't have sex in front of the altar. Okay? Don't, just don't. There's so many other places to do that. You don't have to do it in front of the altar. Um, don't make fun of her. For obvious reasons, right? Don't make fun of her. Um, don't make her compete with other energies. Nobody likes to compete for attention, so don't make her do it. Don't test her. Well, I'll only believe in you if you do this. Well, I'll only do this. I'll only, you know, um, pay homage to you. Or I'll only, uh, <laughs> I'll only uh, do such and such, if you prove yourself to me. She hates that. Don't do that. <laughs> um, don't abandon her because you didn't get what you wanted in three days. I mean, death is patient. So she's patient. You can be patient too. There are exceptions. Life and death situations, obviously. But don't, don't be pissed because you didn't get what you wanted immediately okay uh don't double question her so to elaborate on that there there are instances where we want answers from her and we use divination and um we ask the same thing over and over again expecting a different answer she doesn't like that she told you the first time get the hint if you keep asking her, she just ain't going to answer you after a while. She's just going to be death, which is neutral. Well, the great equalizer. She's just not going to answer you. She's just going to let you leave it up to your, you know, she's, she's going to leave you up to your own devices. So don't double question her. Take the answer the first time. Don't ignore her. Definitely don't ignore her. Give her her fair share of your energy and give her you know, your time. Don't forget her light and her water. Very important. Two very important things. Don't ever forget those two things. Ever, ever, ever. Even if you don't have a lot of money. Even if you have a very, very small altar. Even if you don't even have a picture or, or a statue. It's okay. Just give her, give the, 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 if you have a space set aside, give her some light and give her some water. Obviously, if you don't have a, a, a sacred space to her, then, then I guess ignore that one. Don't forget 
she's a spectrum. Um, yeah. Don't forget that there are people out there that do dark workings with her. Don't ever turn her all light and fluffy to where she's, she's all, you know, super miss innocent who can't do no wrong. No, 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 no. No, she's neutral. So don't ever put it past her to, to, uh, to be helping those do dirty deeds. It's true. More times than most people are just wanting, you know, the basic needs of life and, and people do want innocent things, but you know, she doesn't judge. So don't think that she's incapable of tapping into that, uh, darkity dark side. Don't forget. Uh, don't fight with her. I wouldn't. <laughs> You know, the whole saint shaming thing and doing bad things to the statue, cursing her name. Yeah, just don't fight with her. Just don't do that. Don't compare her. Did I not already say that? I think I did. Yeah, don't compare her to others. She is who she is and that's what she is. Don't try to put her on any kind of scale or ranking system to where she's, well, Santa Muerte is this, but this one can do this. At least don't do it in front of her altar. Um, and more, most important, don't forget to spend time. And don't forget to give some of your energy, you know? She gives her energy to you, you give your energy right back. Spend some time um, right before bed, in the middle of the night if you want, in the morning, during your lunch break, you know, when you're in the shower and you start talking to her, start praying to her, just, you get what I'm saying? When you're driving, it doesn't always have to be right in front of the altar. Just spend time. Just talk. She's everywhere. You can be, multi you can be, you can be, um, up and around. So can she, so does she. So yeah, don't, definitely don't forget to spend time. So like I said, the list of these things were for people no matter where you stand. No matter where you sit. I don't care where you sit with her. These are kind of important. So these are the things not to do with her. Do not do them. Do not do them. Trust me, I'm saving you some pain here. Um, ask anyone. If you don't believe me, it's all good. I I'm still on a journey and I'm still learning. And I'm still growing and I'm learning from... Plenty of people and learning a lot of different things still and always will be. So don't take my word for it. I'm just a YouTuber. So that's about it for now, guys. And I'm going to be doing a live Q&A. Um, I don't know when yet. Maybe next week when I get some peace. But um, thanks for all of you who are watching. And thanks for you that are regular subscribers. Thanks for all of you that you know have the notification bell on. And even thanks for all of you that are watching that don't like me too much. It's okay. You're still watching. So I'll see you all next time.